I've been playing with Jewel Thieves again, and this is a pretty typical one like this. Uh, and I did a video recently on the frequency of this, and typically these things run between 12 and 25 kilohertz. So yeah, uh, roughly in the range of uh, human hearing actually. But I built this one, I've, this is the second one I built. It's a solid state uh, SMD inductor is what it uses, Jewel Thief. Uh, the circuit's quite a bit different, but uh, yeah, it, uh, it has some different properties and I thought we'd take a look at the scope and see how much difference it is than the toroid coil type. Okay, we'll kick on the power supply. And this is half a volt. Now I will say my first one actually worked better, but uh, my, choice of, uh, my choice of inductors on this one uh, has limited the voltage range, which is unfortunate. I used smaller inductors on the first one and it gave me a better range. Okay, but having said that, we'll go on. So if you look at this one, this one is somewhere just below one megahertz. So that's one million hertz. Whereas this one is like 12,000 or to 25,000. Okay, let's boost the voltage. 0 0.5, 0 0.5, 0 0.6. Ah, got a lot more stable. It's right around 800, 7, 790 something uh, kilohertz. So hovering just under one kilohertz. And uh, Duty cycle is about 69%, so a little higher than these. These run about 50% duty cycle. Um, but a nice clean wave, nice steady wave. And now let's bump it up to 0.7 and see what it does. 0.7 and it goes flat. So, yeah, it collapses. So that's kind of sad. I really, uh, I really like this, but the... The limited range on it. Uh, yeah, I, I guess I just have to go build another one and experiment some more. I got to tear apart some more SMD circuit boards and get myself some more of these uh, SMD inductors. Okay, well, this is a short video. Just uh, thought you might find it interesting the difference in frequency operation between these uh, toroid coil type uh, jewel thieves and an SMD inductor uh, type oscillator. Okay, I hope you found that useful and interesting in your home electronic experimentation.